Tiffany here and today I have some jambalaya. Jambalaya. She is piping hot. Y'all see how easy that was to make, you guys? Girl. When I tell y'all I love simple recipes, I love simple recipes, okay? So I found the Jambalaya fixing at Walmart. Um, right along with the chili fixing that I had in my turkey chili video. But it was weird because when I went, when I when I got the chili one, they didn't have the jambalaya one. But when I went to Walmart today, they had the jambalaya. Okay, so, so I definitely gotta try this. So yeah. I'm excited for we. I'm excited. You just add meat to it and everything else is there. Okay. So is it did just call for sausage, but I wanted sausage and shrimp in there. So you know. Let's taste it. Mmm. Mmm. This is so good. Y'all want some? Because I got some left over. I can make you a bowl. The flavor was already there. I just bought it out a little. Like I wanted it a little more spicy. Mm. Yeah, this is so good. <laughs> so good. Oh my god. I see y'all trying to use some. I think the brand is called Simple Suppers. I don't think they're any more than two dollars. You can literally get that. Your whole family, it depends on how much they eat, okay. Oh, that's kind of cramping my foot. The CDC <laughs> has recommended that we wear a cloth mask because the folks that need the surgical mask are running out, so we need to wear the cloth. <laughs> um, so our job handed out cloth mask with like a list of instructions on how to wash it. It's like, um, after five days you need to wash it. There's a coffee filter like inside the mask. <laughs> so when we wash it, we gotta take the coffee filter out and then replace it with another coffee filter. I'm like, girl, I ain't got no coffee filters. I don't drink coffee. <laughs> and it's just crazy because it's been like, what? three weeks to a month that this has been going on and now it's like oh well, we recommend y'all use cloth masks like and didn't they say at some point like the mask weren't even the mask weren't even helpful like so what are the one? Oh, <coughs> she went up my nose not only do we have to be screened before we come into work, we have to make sure we're screened and we have our mask before we go to work. It's like some extra to keep up with. Um, it's all out here to help us. And the funny thing was like, Donald Trump was like, you know, it's optional. You can wear it if you want to, but I'm not going to wear it. And I'm just like... It's like, how are you supposed to be the president and, like, people are looking to you for direction, you know what I mean? And it's just like, you're not going to wear your mask. That's going to cause a lot of other people to not want to wear a mask. And then this mess going to keep spreading. So, girl. That's y'all, president. Okay. 
He ain't got no common sense. I don't want to bash him, but <laughs> I don't want to offend anybody that does support him. They canceled all North Carolina schools until May 15th. A lot of, like, um, parents that I work with said that their children had, like, a prom this weekend. And, of course, they can't, you know, it's canceled. And some people are saying that they'll, they'll probably have to go to school earlier. You know, the kids usually go to school in August. But if they done missed two, three months, like, you know what I mean? They might have to go back in, like, June, July. Or I guess whenever it is. I don't know. I, I don't know. Right. I'm trying to figure out why these folks feel like they got to get all the tissue, all the noodles, all the scatty sauce. <laughs> why do people feel like they have to get all this stuff when the grocery stores aren't going to close? The grocery stores have remained open. Why do you feel like you have to go and get everything as if other people don't have to get stuff too? You know what I mean? There's nothing wrong with being stocked up for a couple weeks, but it's just like... Leave stuff for other people. That's really crazy, y'all. Like, I'm just ready for this to pass over. Like, I still don't think... Life will be back to normal, but it's just a lot. Oh, it's cute. Mm -hmm. Season four of Money Heist is now on Netflix. <laughs> it's a really good series, you guys. I haven't been on Netflix lately. But there are a lot of shows I gotta catch up on. I wanted to see what the hype was about with Love is Blind. Uh, what All American. That, um. Madam C.J. Walker story. All the, like, new and recent stuff. It's not that I don't even have the time, it's just like, when I am off, I'm creating content or like editing videos, I'm like, you know, they say you find time for things you want to do, so. Like today, Money Heist came out, I'm on like episode 6. <laughs> like, I'm making time for Money Heist because I know it's going to be good, you know what I mean, so. That is all, you guys. All right, you guys, that is all for today's video. If you enjoyed, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, oh. <laughs> see ya.